Hi, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to solve a nice algebra equation. X square minus Y square is equal to 24. XY is equal to 35. Here we are going to find out the value of X plus Y. So let's start our solution. First, I'm going to name this equation 1. And this is equation 2. I'm going to start my solution by taking this equation 1. Here I was going to use the algebraic identity a square minus b square is equals to a plus b a minus b. So this will turn to x plus y x minus y is equals to this here the 24 is remaining. Now I was going to raise square both this side. So this will turn to x plus y whole to the power of 2 and x minus y whole to the power of 2 is equal to 24 to the power of 2. Now here I am going to use the algebraic identity that is a plus b whole to the power of 2 is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square and for a negative one it will turn to a negative. So this equation turns to x square plus 2xy plus y square x square minus 2xy plus y square is equal to 24. Now next I will going to plug in here the xy value. So our xy value is 35 x square plus 2 35 plus y square x square minus 2 35 plus y square is equals to 24. Now this will turn to x square plus y square. This will equals to 70. And here x square minus plus y square minus 70 is equal to 24. Now here we have the positive and the negative sign. So this is our A and this is our B value according to this algebraic equation. So I will going to write x square plus y square whole to the power of 2 minus 70 whole to the power of 2 is equals to 24 x square plus y square whole to the power of 2 so it's the mistake here i forgot to put the square so this is square and this will turn to here this will turn to 70 new times give us 4900 is equals to 576. Now here this x square plus y square whole to the power of 2 is equal to 5476. Now here I want to remove this square. So I will going to take root both the side x square plus y square whole to the power of 2 root is equal to plus minus root 5476. Now here this square and this root get cancelled. So the remaining expression we will get that is x square plus y square is equals to plus minus 74. Now in the next step, I was going to add both the side 2xy. x square plus y square plus 2xy is equals to plus minus 74 plus 2xy. So here I add up plus 2xy on this side. You can see this carefully. This is in the form of algebraic equation. That is x plus y whole to the power of 2 is equals to plus minus 74 plus this 2. And I'm going to plug in the value of xy here. That is 35. Now this will equals to x plus y 
whole to the power of 2 is equal to plus minus 74 and this will equal to 70. Now here we get the two solution here. x plus y whole to the power of 2 is equal to positive 74, positive 70. And another x plus y whole to the power of 2 is equal to negative 74 plus 70. Now, first I was going to solve this. x plus y whole to the power of 2 is equal to 74 plus 70. Here, x plus y whole to the power of 2 is equal to 144. Now here I want to remove this square, so I'm going to raise root with this side. Here this square and this root get cancelled. So here we get x plus y is equals to plus minus root 144. x plus y is equals to plus minus. Yeah, I got 12. Now we're going to solve this one x plus y whole to the power of 2 is equal to minus 74 plus 70. Here now x plus y whole to the power of 2 is equal to minus 4 is remaining. Now I will going to remove this square. So I will going to raise here the root both this side. So this and this get cancelled. So the remaining expression we'll get x plus y is equals to plus minus. Here I will going to write this four times negative one root. So in replacement of negative one root, I'm going to write the iota sign. That's the imaginary number x plus y is equals to plus minus. This will equals to two iota express y value that is plus minus 12 and another we got that is plus minus 2i. So this is our final answer. Thank you so very much for watching my video. If you like my video, please do subscribe to my channel.